I mean, I know that both of us were on the side of absolutely it would be, you yeah. know, the value would be better in, in having him step aside and having anybody else. But I, I mean, that, that's pretty like notable. And I can't even think about a political, like a period of political time recently where, where one party's chances would have switched that dramatically over something. Maybe not. No, I, I got to be honest. I thought they would be smaller underdogs, right? That Harris would battle yeah. to like, you know, a tie in the national popular vote and have a disadvantaged electoral college, but have a 30, 35, 40% chance, which is a lot better than Biden. Um, But no, she has, I don't know what happened. She has had some type of, I mean, where was this version of Kamala Harris all along? I think she's been a very good candidate so far. I think even though it's a lot of the same people running the campaign, they've picked from a new kind of color palette um, of themes that just seem, seem a lot smarter and sharper. And like the people who were like, yeah, look, I'm, I, I'm, uh, I was going to say pleasantly surprised. Yeah, that's fair to say, I suppose. Um, yeah. You know, I don't want to talk too much about my personal political preferences, but I think she's been a, a, off to a very good start. 